easy chairs for sure, demonstrating the programmable using the mode power supply. Have, uh, this is the uh, LCD for display, the pulse width. Then you have two buttons one is to increase or decrease the current for the pulse width, and uh, have the digital multimeter to measure the current. The current is in, is in milliseconds. Now, I have the components involved here. I have uh, this MOSFET here. I have uh, the scotch diode here. And uh, I have the, the inductor here. It has the load is in terms of uh, the resistor here, which is a 2 ohm resistor, and this one ohm resistor which also has a capacitor for filtering. Now, when you change the pulse width, we expect the current at the output to change. The meter is connected in series with the, with the output. Actually, I connected it from the output here, the, the last resistor, and the ground. And the, here, if you check and see the scale, I put in 200 milli, 200 milli amps. So let's test it and see if it works. Now at the moment, this is the set maximum, and that is the maximum current. What I can do is to reduce, see if I can reduce this current. So I press my button. Okay. I can see I have reduced the pulse width here, and also the current it has dropped so you can continue to reduce see okay clear yeah i put this at the minimum so it locks that so you can see let me see if i can increase it good yes so this is the simplest switching mode for supply you can use uh, this is the back switching mode power supply is the use of just a MOSFET. For this time I use the uh, any channel MOSFET and uh, about uh, 10 milli micro Henry's inductor, then a scotch diode there, and then the, the resistor as my load, two resistors. Then that's it. It's very simple and easy. Oh, maybe to add, I use the pulse with this moderation which are you which uh, is generated programmed from this PSOC. Pulse with this we will go at the the gate of the uh, the MOSFET and then it does the work. That's it. Thank you.